Hey, what's up guys? It's Nelson here with Gadjax, and today I'm going to show you how to create a floating browser window so that you can view videos from anywhere on your Mac. The application that we're going to be using is called Helium. You can download it for free directly from their website or we have a direct download link over at the Gadget Hacks article. Once you download it, you'll see a window like this, which will tell you to navigate to a web page using the location menu in the menu bar. So I'm going to click on location. I'm going to go to open web URL and I'm going to enter netflix.com and then click load. And this takes me to Netflix. So now all I have to do is click on a video and now you can see the video playing inside of Helium. If for some reason the video doesn't play for you, you'll need to download the Silverlight plugin uh, through Safari. You can also find a download link in the article over at Gadget Hacks. So when you open another app, the floating window will stay above any application you open. That way you can continue whatever you're working on and watch the video at the same time. So in addition to Netflix, you can also open web URLs for YouTube, uh, Vimeo or any other video streaming websites. You can also open files that are on your computer. So here I have a mp4 that I can open up and built-in controls will show up that you can use to control the video, fast forward, play and pause, and change the volume. You can also change the size of the window, you can make it pretty small, and you can also make it pretty big. One pretty awesome feature that you can use is called translucent. So you can either hit Command T on your keyboard or click on translucent here. The video becomes a bit transparent. You can change how transparent it is. So it's at 60. If I put it up to 80, it looks a bit better. But the awesome thing about when it's translucent is that you'll be able to click behind the floating window. So if I want to control anything behind it, all I have to do is click on it. And you can see that I click play and it worked in the application behind the window. With this feature enabled, you won't be able to move the floating window. You'll either need to hit Command T on your keyboard or you'll need to click on Helium in the dock. If you do have any problems with the video playback, then you can also click on location and either click on reload or clear. All right, well, that's it. Thanks, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and check out the full tutorial over at Gadget Hacks. All right, thanks, guys.